Hello, Shining Ones. Today is Tarot Tuesday, and we're going to do a pick a card. So before I even started this video, I, I got a tarot deck, an oracle deck, shuffled them up, and, and just asking the universe for a message to my wonderful friends. And so what I want you to do is just use your intuition. Uh, pile one, pile two, pile three. Which one do you feel calling to you? Which one do you feel is a message from the universe for you? It, it can be one, it can be two, it can be all three, it can be none. It, you, you can stay and watch all of them because all of them I know will have a good message, maybe for a different time in your life. But but which one right now do you feel is your message from spirit? All right, let's start with pile one. We have the full card and the oracle card says change maker make waves so so you can see in the full card he set off on a new adventure there, there's something new coming uh it, there's an excitement uh, things are going to be different it, it's a new cycle a new season. And you know, it's something I've always loved about this is just the expression on his face. It's very childlike. You remember when you're a kid, you could do and be anything. It's time for that feeling again. And you know, we want to make sure not to be naive. Yes, it's new. It's, it's an adventure, but we want to be wise. We want to go in with eyes wide open. Uh, don't be too arrogant. You know, and you'll notice he's a, he's about to step off of a cliff there. Big smile on his face, flower in his hand, sun shining. He's so excited and he's about to step off of a cliff. But look, he's got a little helper, the little dog right there barking, trying to get his attention. Whoa. So let, let, let's be mindful. Let's be very aware and awake as we go on this new adventure. And, and we never know where uh, wisdom might come from. You know, don't be thinking, oh, you're just a dog. I'm a human. You, you know, let's not get too full of ourselves, especially as we're starting something new, something we haven't done before. Let's be wise. Uh, change maker. It goes along perfect with this, doesn't it? Because he, he's making a change. M maybe you've been doing the same thing. Maybe you feel stuck. You feel stagnant. It's time to make a, a change. You know, uh, maybe it's work. Maybe it's relationship. Maybe it's spiritually. Maybe you've been playing a game that's rigged against you. And you know what? You're ready to step out of that arena, go into something new. My friends, better days ahead. You know, and as we go through these, uh, go to the comments and tell me, does this resonate with you? With, with the pile you pick, does it resonate? I'd love to hear. All right, pile two. Oh, this is a good card. This is the Nine of Pentacles. And, and this is uh, success. You, you know, this is, uh, you, you planted the seeds and, and this is the harvest. And, uh, it, it, you know, it's something I'm thinking about it is, uh, you know, the Christ said, he who has more will be given to him. It's, it's about frequency. And as, as you're in this time of success and reward, I want you to go into that feeling of that frequency, of that vibration of success. So, so you'd be in resonance for more. You, you've got the right thinking right now. You've got that right idea, that, that right frequency. I, I want you to attune yourself to that hold that and watch how now you're a channel for more of that success all right let's see what our oracle says it says collaboration of souls that that is beautiful collaboration of souls you, you know it, it's a uh, divine appointments it's synchronicity it's the right people coming into your life at the right time it's making sure that you're surrounding yourselves with other like-minded people we don't want to collaborate and connect our minds and souls and ideas and frequency with people going in the wrong direction right with negative thinking 
with wrong beliefs, uh, uh, this collaboration of souls, we want to make sure we're in with the right minded people, people like us, people headed in the direction we are going. Very important to maintain that success. All right, pile three. Okay, so pile three, it's the five of cups. And, and you know what? Uh, at first glance, yes, this is a card of loss. You'll see a man and he's looking at his sp three spilt cups. You can see some depression, just head bowed. Uh, but, but, but I want you to see this. Yes, there was a loss, but you know what? He, he's got two standing cups here and energy, energy grows uh, where focus goes. So let's not stay focused on the loss. Let's look at what we have, right? Again, it's about energy. And then something I've always thought beautiful, this card, look at, there's a castle over here and there's a bridge to that castle, to that better days, that better life. Don't, don't be focused down here. Let's not keep our energy here. Yeah, there was a loss. Maybe it was sad. Maybe it was a relationship, a, a, a business idea, something we thought was going to go this way. And now we just, we, you, you, you might feel like you can't get over this loss. You can. You have other standing cups and you have a bridge to that castle, to that better days. Let's see what our oracle says. Find your sacred flow. Oh, that's beautiful. Find your sacred flow. This wasn't your flow. This wasn't your sacred flow. This isn't what you incarnated into time and space and a body in this earth for. My friends, it, it, it's a blessing it's spilt over. That relationship, that business would have taken you to ruin. My friends, the universe ain't going to let that happen. You've got the two cups you need. You've got the bridge to go to where you were headed in the first place. This is your success. This was not. Let it go. I got goosebumps through my body on that one. My God, my God. What a beautiful reading. Thank you, good spirit. Isn't that beautiful? We can set an intention. Ask spirit for a message directly to us. And we, we're a channel to that, my friend. That's beautiful. Did you guys enjoy that? Go to the comments. Let me know. Let me know what pile you picked. And did it resonate with you? All right, guys. Be blessed. I love you so much. And we'll see you next time.